Gallagher. No. Never mind. Why? I accidentally stopped the recording. Alright, we're gonna just show off what this cannon does. That's cool. Yeah. For eat, eat, no. I want 720p, buster. You don't get to change my quality automatically, YouTube. You're an idiot. Well, yeah, that's that's what it is. Also, Sometimes I it will lag it too much if you change it to the higher quality. Oh, Just... by the way, forgot to mention that. If you fall in the lava in this map, there are now kill blocks in this map, which if you touch the kill block, it'll kill you. So if you fall down in this lava, you are gonna die. You will not survive. Even. And here it is, the artillery cannon. Yes. The artillery unit. We can use this artillery to for military purposes. And that is why we will have artillery. It is used. So, what should we use this for in the future, though? We should use it for wasting wasting artillery. That's what we should use it for. And also for shooting down walls. But most importantly, wasting ordnance. <laughs> Alrighty then, we're just gonna skip right to the memory base. Memory base for our human. Ooh, come on, Piggy needs to be sent to the memory base. It's hurry up. Memory base, memory base, memory base. It's time for memory. We're now going to to, to see memory. Today, memory yeah. is existing. We must we must try and, and understand this is, memory. Look, this is the security office. It's which not that interesting. But it is well designed, I'll give it that, hey. And then we got to Jesus Christ the memory base. It's a, it's a, Josh, have you even seen the memories of the previous maps in the memory base? I don't think you have. I... It's memory. The creepy memories. What does this behold? We went through a black hole. Oh, and then this no. is a corrupted version of a previous Look. map. Uh, no, it is not. Look at this. Josh, these walls are the colors of an insulin eye, if you don't know. But she's actually clever. But things are really corrupted. It's here too. Like, how did this happen? Yes, how did this happen? How did this color scheme come out of nowhere? This color scheme is very, very, very painful to look at. <laughs> actually, no it's not. The color scheme is actually pretty interesting if you think about it. Yes, the color scheme is pretty interesting, but at the same time, it's also it's Josh. also a color scheme. <laughs> All right, Josh, time to guess the map. Can you guess what this map is right here? It looks like the it looks like the Shadow Realm because it's so black and dark and no, blackness. no, in the series, in the third series, this is a map from the third series. Um, I really don't know. I don't want to guess. Just it's just... a stadium, dude. It's a stadium map. Come on, dude. You know, you know the area with the water, the blue water, the stadium map. That area with the bridges. It's okay. this area. Okay. Well, we must. We must continue. We must continue. Continue. On a side note, look at how corrupt this place is. Oh my lord! What happened? A glitch just came out of nowhere and started it started corrupting everything. The place was corrupted by the glitch. Uh, no. You know that the sorcerer is responsible for doing this, right? The sorcerer the sorcerer is the glitch. Do you want to yes, clever about this map, Josh? You get to go through a portal that's supposed to go to your previous memories based on the previous map. That's it. So, what do you think of that memory base so far? In terms of it's, its design? It's very corrupted and glitched, but... But does it look interesting? 
Yes, because of the corruption and glitching. Who would be expecting that? Josh, who would be expecting that memory maze to return in this chapter, huh? Who memory they? maze. It's very memory filled. It's yeah. memories. You make memories. Yeah, memory maze. Make memory memories. Maze, the memory maze is pretty badass looking, too. I'm not gonna lie. Well, I wouldn't say that, but it, 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 it's, it, it looks interesting, I guess. Sorcerer, the sorcerer, what did you do? Sorcerer, what the hell did you do? Yes, what the hell did you do? What is wrong with you? <laughs> now, can you guess what this map is? Do you remember this? It kind of looks like the, the studio map. Correct, you actually guessed it right, it is. It's actually the area where because you all the in. red. But except the red is corrupted, it's actually a little more pleasant to look at, hey. The red is more pleasant to look at this time. It's okay, not just play the video. Play the video. Play the video. We need to look at this. You need to give that to Mimi if you if you have to do anything with it. Wait, how is Mimi even here to begin with? She was waiting for us in the tunnel, remember? Maybe the maybe the corrupted and glitched source happened to teleport Mimi here. <laughs> oh my because God. that's the only explanation as to why. Sorcerer, like, what is wrong with you? Why do you need to make her involved in this? Sorcerer's an asshole, dude. He's always gonna be one, too. But, hey. The button. Button. Yes. yes. You can get where this map is headed to, right? We are going to the, um... Try. We're going to the existence, I guess. R. E. F. O. Resort. R. Yes! Got it! You know how you can tell it's a resort map? Because the brown portal. Brown color scheme. Brown. Today we're going to make everything brown, and it will be brown. Also, can you hear that whispering near the portal? There's just some little whispering noise. No, and I don't care. You haven't paid attention to the story, right? Because the whispers, you're just there for no reason. Okay. And that is basically the memory made. It's the, it's the, and then we got the ending, which is, oh my lord, the ending reveal a lot, hey. We're gonna kind of skip past third parts of the ending. So the ending actually, starts actually, it's a, we don't need to watch the ending. It's, we already, just, just leave it, if, if other players want to see it, then they can just go play it themselves. You can't just oh, give we don't them the ending for, for free. <laughs> oh, we don't want to spoil people, do we? Yeah, we don't want to spoil people. So let's not give them the ending for free, please. <laughs> Alright, then you get to explain the story. I hope you remember everything that, that was told to you. But there's a lot, hey. The end. Right, it's, it's a lot. I think you should explain the story. Right, I'm only good at, remember, good at remembering what happened, not exactly what was right, told. Then, but then you get to explain the first half of the story. Basically what happened there. Well, so how do you start we find that we, we go to the... We go to the... Ins, we, are, we get trapped inside the mine again. And then, and then the source appears. The source, uh, the source apparently reveals to us that he he brainwashed the, the, the Baron. Baron, yeah, he brainwashed Baron. 
So now, but but at, at the same time, the player figures out how to unbrainwash John. Yeah, basically what we were doing in that day. You know, we're basically erasing John's bad memories by destroying him. Yeah. 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 And by the time it's finished, yeah, we you use have the John back. Yes, yeah, but yeah, he is going to turn back into an infected. And the worst we also use since we have six pages, we also find pages of the code of the scroll. So, uh, so guess what? We can track the sensor in the memory bank for whoever well, John was brainwashed for. So that's good. So we don't have to worry about the torture for a while. Okay. Basically, yeah. Uh, not a lot of. I'm gonna make this right now, Josh. Not a lot happens in the first half of the cutscene. Like, sure, there is some tension. If he finally got rid of the torture for a while, but there's really not that much. Eh? There is story. There is lore, though. There is lore that is revealed. There is and lore. There's, and there's a lot of it. Let's get to the second half. The second half reveals a lot of lore. <laughs> yeah, basically. Yeah. yeah. You find a piggy outside. Like of the building. You found the piggy outside the offices. And well, um, um, she said, hey, please just leave me alone. You've already done enough, man, eh? Hey. Yeah. It's like, she wants us to screw on it so badly. Yes. We just won't go away. Well, yeah. he goes and keeps on annoying Piggy. Alrighty then. Yeah. Basically, yeah, that's funny. That's real funny. Basically, he explains that the sorcerer was actually a, 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 basically a killed second hand of man. The second hand of man. That's that, that some point. And the sorcerer was actually a friend with the idiot. And John, let's just say this might have taken a lot of people to be surprised. Or some people. Look. Well, what happened? Well, it is okay that the two of us but the others around him, the other people, the influence of the danger of a blind magic I will use, is the victory to torture innocent people. However, then some of the people, the influence, the followers of the influence, start making fun of it. And three, when the weakest gods out there, this didn't really know much. Because you know many magic skills, despite the knowledge of a lot of magic power. Which, why would you do this? You idiotic people, man. And then, this is where things get dark. Really dark, hey. Right? Extreme darkness, the point where um where it's basically like the shadow realm, where yes, nothing but sorcerer. darkness in is encases you. <laughs> yeah, basically the sorcerer actually actually gets pissed out of people, people were making fun of him, and he wants revenge badly. Hmm. He's not happy. And that is when he turns into this this. This piece, of, this piece of nonsensical, randomly generated piece of nonsense. You can say it, who cares? He's up shooting. He's, he's, he's just as bad at Ro as Roblox at this point. He's just as bad. Maybe but that's what makes him a good villain. Because he wanted revenge on the people. He wanted to show the world. Basically, he wanted the people to stop being for the sorcerer, and they never did. Okay. Already dead. Sorcerer basically starts to revenge and starts to creating a rebellion for the sorcerer. 
Or sorry, I thought you thought like Bell did to people, like who was brainwashing them and killing them. And he started teaching them more magic. He said, Do you think he was in another world? That's like an evil one. Well, when he became a dismiss, however, when he became too powerful, powerful, like, you had to put him in his own grave. You had to kill him and put him in his grave. In two new lines, basically. And then... Basically, um... Then Piggy, yeah. yeah, then Piggy, I think you're a squeezer. Or, or the... Squeezer uh, has to brainwash Dragon to the Infinity... Infinity for power. However, she ends up... When Dragon is not the author, she ends up... Something to say to her. Thinking that be a change. Which, why do you think that a change? At all. Hmm. What do you think was happening then? No. He started reapplying the events of the corrupted prophecy. He gave it prophecy that was a destructive fate of the world, like a really bad fate of all the world. Which was a great chaos. He started reapplying the events of the corrupted prophecy yet again. He started to curse the angels. This is the first scroll was created. The first scroll was created basically yeah, to uh, uh, stall the power of the sorcerer. And then how did we have to stop the sorcerer? How to stop the sorcerer, too. Okay. Yes. Outside that, yeah, that's how all this was started. Basically, it's the good source of evil or people. He also informed us that John that when somebody's brainwashed, once they are unbrainwashed, and they were infected before they were brainwashed, they will become infected a few hours after. Oh, do you think a few weeks after they were brainwashed? But luckily, if you don't remember, we have the cure. Cure for the, the, the virus. But we don't know if that's going to work. Did you already listen to the effect of the virus? We don't know yet. And they say Piggy joins the alliances with us to help us find what thing that they did for the first scroll on it. Which do. Okay. Which, and, yeah. But, yeah, maybe find out that everybody who stayed in the. He also revealed so that if there's a machine up north called. Controlling the corrupted infected, controlling the brainwash. So basically, we have to go on work and try to stop it. We know that the sorcerer is headed up there. He's headed up north. Okay. I think we, that's where the story ends. But just, we go back to a radio, which is supposed to be emitting a weird corrupted static. And all of a sudden, the sorcerer teleports, but somehow he escaped the memory base. We don't know how, but we did. But he's back, and that's where the story ends. Well, now it's time to, to rate it. What would you rate it? Let's see what you would rate that. Hmm. I'd give it solid. Fantastic. I think it's a fantastic map, to be honest. It is better than Chapter 12. You gotta admit, the sign's good, eh? But it's not better than Chapter 2 or Chapter 5. I mean, right, it is better than Chapter 2 and Chapter 12, but not better than Chapter 5, which is a good rating. And that is, my friends, is the tier list of every map. This took us, like, 50 minutes to do, so I hope you enjoyed this. And goodbye.